Hey guys, it's Lucy, just popping in to say hi. Um, I did a lot of stuff today with my mom, a lot of errands and stuff we had to get done. So, I'm really, really tired. I don't really feel like making a video, but I'm going to make one anyway. Um, somebody asked me a question that I don't really want to answer, and I'm not, I'm, I mean, I'm going to answer it, but like, it's just, they asked me, like, if I have a job, and no, I don't have a job, um, and I don't really want to get into why, because, um, it has a lot to do with, like, depression, like, I have depression and anxiety and stuff like that, and, um, with this, um, video blog, I don't want to talk about negative stuff, like, Maybe in the future, like, if people really want to hear, like, my story and stuff like that, that's whatever. But right now, it's just, I don't really want to talk about it. I just, you know, um, yeah, I don't have a job. Um, I don't know how to drive a car. I can't drive. It's, uh, kind of scared to, honestly. Um, but yeah, just, I mean, I do stuff, though. Like, I'm not just, like an invalid or anything, you know, um, I clean, you know, I do the dishes, I keep, like, my cat's stuff clean, um, and I make bracelets, I'm trying to get that started so maybe I can have a job from home, and I know, I know it's not, like, ideal, it's not, like, uh, whatever, but, I guess I can explain a little bit to you guys. Maybe you'll understand. I'm just afraid that people won't understand. And they'll think I'm, like, weak or, like, lazy or something. Um, I have this thing called emetophobia. It is a fear of throwing up. It's um, really, really weird. I know you're probably like, what the fuck? Well, look it up because it's actually... It's really common in children. A lot of children have it, but um, they mostly just grow out of it, and I just didn't grow out of it. So, yeah, I'm afraid of throwing up. I mean, no one likes to throw up, but I like I have panic attacks sometimes, and uh, yeah. So, getting jobs is hard for me because of the anxiety. Because I'm afraid to go anywhere because I'm afraid I'm gonna throw up. It's not as bad as it used to be, like. Because I take medication now, you know, like I take anxiety medication and um, I also have my trusty Finnergan with me all the time. I don't really have to take it as much because um, I've been eating healthier. I've been, I've beat anorexia pretty much. Um, that's another thing that I don't really want to get into too much, but um, yeah, I just, whenever I have a job, like... It can't be for long periods of time because I won't eat. Like, that's just, that's just how it is. I won't eat. And, um, it makes me really sick. It makes me, like, sicker than if I did eat, which is stupid. It's so stupid. I hate it. But, um, yeah, I'm trying to get over this fear. Um, exposure therapy is really important. Um, uh, watching Tosh.0, wa watching, watching Tosh.0 and stuff like that, you know, where he shows a bunch of videos of people puking, like, that actually, like, helps, and I have, um, got to the point where I can, like, I used to not be able to, like, I, you can't even say the word around me, like, I'd freak out, it, it was bad, but, um, yeah, like, in high school, it was bad, like, I had to take a Finnegan every day, even if I didn't feel sick, because I would start panicking anyway if I felt a little sick, which I usually would feel sick because I wasn't eating, so it was just, like, it was me doing it to myself, but, uh, yeah, I didn't know I was gonna talk about this, this is weird, <laughs> um, I'm a weird person, you know, I believe that we all have, like, you know, phobias of stuff, like, I also have trypophobia, Oh my god, like, if you have it, like, it's fear of holes, like, uniform holes in, like, things, like, kind of like a lotus flower, like, lotus flower pods or whatever. Yeah, like, but that's, like, some kind of, 
like, primitive shit. Like, if you have a uh, trypophobia, like, usually it's because it's, like, in your DNA to just, like, be wary of things that have holes because they could be poisonous. And just when I look at things that have holes, like, you can look it up, and if you don't have trypophobia, if you do have it, don't look it up. Oh, my God. And I'm so sorry if you look it up and find out that you have it, but, um, yeah, just, like, it doesn't scare you. You're not, like, screaming, running away from it. You just feel uncomfortable, and it just, it doesn't look natural. You don't want to look at it. Like, it makes your skin crawl. It makes you a little nauseous, but, yeah, um, yeah, so I'm weird as hell, but so are you, so fuck off, <laughs> just kidding, um, yeah, so this is like the longest video I've ever made besides the bracelet video, so I'm gonna head off here and, I don't know, do something, so yeah, um, ask me other questions, you know, you never know what I want to talk about. I usually just talk off the cuff or whatever, but I'll see you guys later. Bye.